Sorry about that, guys. I uh, cut off um, in part two. Um, let's just get right on into this, back into this. Okay, so we were on Page of Cups. Um, so yeah, uh, as a person, the Page of Cups um, can seem really simple on the outside. Um, but they're very complex internally. Okay, so you guys are very, this could be uh, you, um, this could be a younger person in your life, uh, this could be someone representing this energy in your life, um, or like I said, it could be your attitude about, you know, it could be the way that you're seeing things. You're seeing things in a naive perspective, or you're seeing things in a... Um, you know, in a, in a, in a different perspective, in a younger, uh, mindset. Okay. Or you're having a younger mindset, uh, possibly. Um, you tend to observe or the page of cups tends to observe their attitude to life as one of receptivity. Okay. This is about gaining insight and perspective from approaching something and seeing things through different eyes, okay? So that, that could very well be why this card's showing up. You know, you may be seeing things in a perspective that is not conducive to, you know, letting, letting go. Um, and maybe you need to look through different a different set of eyes okay you need to nurture your feelings and go with the flow and the more honest you are about what you want and where you stand you know the the harder it is for someone to step on you the harder it is for someone to take advantage or to hurt you um, you know, having that stability and knowing what you want and being firm in who you are um, also provides a sense of happiness and peace in your life. Um, sometimes this can, sometimes this card can, um, can represent pregnancy or conception. Uh, sometimes. Um, let's, let's go on to the next one. Okay. So the next one for your environment. Okay. You got the four of pentacles. So your environment is four of pentacles. Now this again can be you. It could be this person you're dealing with. This could be, uh, what's going on around you. Um, the Four of Pentacles has to do with holding back. Um, that could be, you know, it could be greed. It could be um, holding back from a, from a situation or holding back from making a decision. It can be holding back from recognizing the truth. It can be holding back from not letting go of these negative thoughts or holding back from seeking help. Okay, it could be holding back from using logic. Um, holding back from taking responsibilities. Maybe, you know, in some situations or in some of your cases, maybe someone's having an issue with accepting the responsibility. We've got the Page of Cups here. This is a naive personality. This is a younger mindset. This could be a person who does not want to accept responsibilities, who does not want to deal with what life has presented them with, whatever this Wheel of Fortune has presented them with. You know, you may have been presented with a situation, um, you know, a circumstance that has caused you heartache, has caused you mental confliction. Um, 
you're unwilling to see the truth, you're unwilling to make a decision, you're holding back from taking the responsibility. Okay, so that's that's once another scenario that I've got coming in. Um sorry, four of pentacles. This can also be saving. This could be saving money. This could be uh saving money to a degree that you are being selfish, okay? Um, if you're not, it's just a warning against that. If you are saving money and you're keeping money or, you know, uh, material belongings or material things and you're holding back from sharing, that could be a warning against that, a warning against greed. Um, this could be shallow happiness. Um, Um, so yeah, this could be, <sighs> it could also represent taking all that you've got, okay? Um, a situation in life may have, may have you in a state of mind where you feel that you need to hold on to whatever it is you have, um, there may have been some type of loss, okay? And that's got you holding on, okay? Holding on or holding back. Um, this could also be Someone, you know, going without something that they need. Um, it could mean that, you know, things are being kept from you or stolen from you. So this could mean a lot of uh, various things. Um, I definitely see this as holding back from accepting something whether they whether that's the responsibility or the truth um i definitely see that um let's see for your hopes dreams and fears i pulled the two of pentacles the Two of Pentacles is about balance and juggling, which obviously that is what's going to happen, whether it's already happening in your life and you're, you know, you're adding those responsibilities with the Ten of Wands, um, you know, with that decision, you know, with that decision, and maybe you decide to add that responsibility, um, so this is juggling all of your responsibilities. This is about balancing your home life, your work life, your love life, okay? Your needs, your family's needs. Okay, so it's about all of all of everything. It's about juggling all that you've got on your plate. Um, it could also be, you know, a warning not to neglect something. Um, you know, sometimes when we have a lot on our plates, um, we tend to forget about certain things or certain things go unattended to. Um, and, you know... This also, in some cases, can represent a person who's putting an act on an act. Um, that they are balancing life and that they are getting through life and that they're taking on their responsibilities and they're doing what they need. But in reality, the truth may be that they are not or that they have 